Hello everyone, my name is Jay Ching. I'm an undergraduate student at UH pursuing a degree in public health. This summer, I had the opportunity to be working under my primary mentor, Dr. Mapuana Antonio, and my secondary mentor, Dr. Kevin Cassell, on two projects called a systematic review of breast cancer studies in Hawaii and a qualitative study from the perspectives of Native Hawaiian adults with cancer-related experiences. For our research, the social ecological model was used and was also used to offer public health recommendations to health-related officials. For our study one, which was the uh, systematic review of breast cancer studies in Hawaii, we first developed our search terms and searched electronic databases, where we found our articles and imported them into Rayon, where we applied our inclusion and exclusion criteria, and finally we evaluated the articles using the Prisma flowchart. For our second study, my mentor and I reviewed and coded interview transcriptions of Native Hawaiian adults with cancer-related experiences compared to those without these um, cancer experiences. We used the paper and pencil method to identify any emerging themes and sub-themes within these um, interview transcriptions. And finally, we selected direct quotes from the interviews that we felt best represented the themes and sub-themes identified through the coding process. For the results of study one, we found that most breast health interventions conducted in Hawaii, the participants' um, demographics were age range about 18 to 92, and they were predominantly Native Hawaiian. The study design most often used was non-experimental, and for the theoretical frameworks or approaches most often used were CBPR approaches and spirituality-based approaches. One novel finding that I would like to share for, um, with you all today from this study is that breast health interventions that include the community as well as integrate cultural sensitivity may best address the needs of these diverse cultural groups. For our second study, we found five emerging themes from the codebook. The first theme was individual health, which is on the individual level of the social ecological model, which I mentioned in the beginning. The second theme is stress, which is also on the individual level. The third theme was social support, which was on the interpersonal level. The fourth theme was knowing that there are options, which is on the institutional level. And finally, the fifth theme was spirituality and reflections of the Native Hawaiian community, which is on the community level of the social ecological model. One novel finding that I would like to share from this, from the code book is that, all, that cancer is an extremely um, stressful situation, but those with cancer-related experiences reported this resilience, and they coped with medical adversity in surprisingly positive ways, increasing their at positive attitudes and overall had this deeper appreciation for life. However, there are limitations with these two studies in that they are specific to Hawaii and that findings are not generalizable due to their relatively small sample sizes. However, our findings emphasize the importance of reflecting on culturally sensitive interventions. Lastly, we have public health recommendations which align with the social ecological model I mentioned in the beginning. So to health-related officials, we offer recommendations that may provide some insight on integrating culturally sensitive um, interventions on the individual level, the interpersonal level, the community level, um, the organizational level, and finally, the public policy level. Thank you for taking the time to listen to my presentation today. And if you have any questions, please feel free to contact me at jnc22 at hawaii.edu. And I again would like to acknowledge my mentor, Dr. Mapuana Antonio and Dr. Kevin Cassell for guiding me through this research over the summer. Thank you very much.